Good evening, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. We are going to be continuing from where we left off in Echoes of Oblivion. If you haven't already, please make sure that you hit the notification bell so that you don't miss any future uploads. And if you haven't already and you enjoy today's content, please make sure you like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel, and I greatly appreciate it. Let's get underway. Admiral Ego is doing the best he can. There are limited resources. Admiral Ego is no longer in charge, so they really should change that. I realize this is something you must do without me, but. I couldn't let you go without at least wishing you luck. The way this is unfolding, I'm completely disheartened. I never dreamed we'd face Valkorion again. And now you must do so without my help. I can't stand the thought of you out there facing him alone. I'll pace the halls until you return. Don't worry, Lana. I'll be back with you as soon as I can. We wouldn't want you to wear the floors down. No, we wouldn't want that, would we? I hate to ruin the moment, but we need to talk. What is it, Theron? I hope there's room for one more on that shuttle, because I'm going with you. That's not a good idea. You could get infected like Satil and her students. Or worse. I know it's risky, but Satil is in trouble. I have to help. You can't help yourself. I lost one parent. I'm not just standing by and letting the other one go. Not if there's something I could do to save her. Whatever the Emperor is doing, I can resist it. I was on Zyost. He didn't control me then. Sure as hell won't let him affect me now. Sorry to interrupt your send-off, but we need to get going. I'm going too. That is really not a good idea. Kira is correct. Too many are already infected by Tenebrae's weapon. Bringing you is too great a risk. That's not your call to make. The only orders I'm following are the commanders. All right then. What do you think? I wasn't expecting anyone to offer to come with us. Especially since we don't truly know what we're up against. We're going to need all the support we can get. Thank you. If that is your decision. It is. Then let us proceed as carefully as possible. This changes the entire plan. Deal with it. I wish you all good luck, and I'll keep our forces here on high alert. Should you need us, just say the word. We appreciate the support, Lana. Thank you. Whatever you need. Enough talk. Let us depart before we lose the droid. Taken there and along. I just know I'm going to end up regretting it. And he played the parent card, and I felt kind of bad. So. 
Only slightly, though. It won't change what needs to be done. I've already tried to kill Satil once, so... We're here, scanning the transport. Power fluctuations, system failures. Looks like the engines are out of commission. There's a ship parked in the hangar bay, but I can't tell if it's T7 shuttle or the servants. There's our answer. We'll have to go in through one of the airlocks, but we can't connect while they're shooting at us. Leave them to me. Seeing you all didn't want to bring him along. He's locked on and sealed. At least. We're ready to go in. No matter what we find, we'll do what must be done. Understood? We will not hesitate. Embrace the power. For the record, this ship was not creepy when we left. Well, it certainly is now, isn't it? Now it's the compressor. Impossible! I checked it not five minutes ago. Check it again. What's going on down there? We must leave immediately. Doesn't make sense. Every time we repair one system, another fails. That must be T7's handiwork. Wonder where he's hiding. Let's find a way to take these guys down quietly once their boss disconnects. No sense. You will not escape. The ship will be your tomb. You were saying. Come on! Barely begun. It's good to see you too, little guy. Great work stalling them till we could get here. So these guys aren't our only problem then? Who else would even know about this? It doesn't matter. Anyone who stands against us will die. Must die. Agreed. We can't afford to take any chances. Shoot first, questions later. Let's keep everyone contained. Then we'll worry about who's killing who. Alright, I'll take T7 and make sure the engines and hyperdrive are permanently shut down. Weapons and shields, too. Just in case. We must still ensure that no one who has boarded this ship can leave. We cannot risk this corruption spreading. We should check all the escape pods then launch them before anyone can use them. That mystery shuttle in the hangar, too. T7 can take our shuttle out once we've finished sabotaging everything. Agreed. Stay on comms.
survive. why his healing's not doing so well. He's only a companion level one. Oh well. I'm not gonna waste companion gifts on someone I really don't use. So I think we'll just stealth as much as we can. This ship is... huge. Yes. Huge? Yes. Is there a question? Why such a huge ship? Oh, it doesn't matter. We need to stay focused.
Just bought two more servants. They must have packed them in tight on those shuttles. That's the last of them. Tenebrae's dogs won't escape us now. You truly hate them, don't you? They are beyond contempt. They betrayed their empire, betrayed the entire galaxy, to absolutely no purpose. To be a Sith is to break your own chains, to choose your own path, and overcome all that stands in your way. These wretches wear the name Servant with pride. They happily enslave themselves to a madman. That the Sith ever tolerated them is repugnant. That we still contend with their delusions after all these years. Today we eliminate them, once and for all. I will savor each death. Let's make our way to the hangar. We need to find out who else seeks to wear the former Emperor's chains. Such anger and conviction. We left only a few droids to guard the ship. To cause this much damage, someone else must have been fighting the servants. These scorch marks are from lightsabers. Yes. The servants use them. But who was here to fight them? That's an Eternal Empire shuttle. From Zaku. Old servants and new. Vying for scraps from their once great master. Pathetic. Whoever they are, they'll die with the rest. Precisely. Hmm. I sense no one on board. Shield generators are toast. We're taking the weapons offline now. We've launched all of the escape pods and cleared the hangar. There may be Zakulans on board. Just what we needed. We'll keep our eyes open. Time to take the bridge. I'm ready. Still clear out here. Once you've got the ship disabled, I'll come back you up. How could you afford a ship this size? We didn't. Kira stole it. Hey, don't drag me into this. I wanted to take the Corvette. Faster, the more power. Sith. I need my space. Ah! <laughs> 
I hate it when the camera decides to do things on its own. are history, this thing won't be moving another centimeter. Unless an even bigger ship comes along to tow it, of course. No! Sorry, sorry, you're right. There is no ship big enough to tow a scrap pile this size. Enough! Scions of Zakul. Their leader told me they would return when it was their time to die. They must have taken the ship off course in the first place. But were they trying to hide from us? Or the servants? Are they allies or enemies? The Scions helped me, but only because I was fighting Arkan. They're loyal to Valkorion, not us. Then they will see no mercy from me. So many lives lost. It must end, here and now. Oh, you again. Revan. The end is closer than ever before, but the threat is as dire as we could have imagined. The ritual inscribed on Tenebrae's body, the plague that was unleashed, is feeding on its victims' minds. Tenebrae is being remade. I can feel it. You must intervene before it's too late. It would be simpler to destroy the entire ship. Even that may not end the threat. You must destroy his very essence, not just the flesh he's attempting to steal. That is our plan. Kira will lead us in meditation. We will join our minds with Satil's and end his blight on the galaxy forever. Then go, quickly. I will aid you as best I can. Yeah, every time we fight him, we say we're ending his threat to the galaxy forever, Kira, and yet he's still The bridge still has returns. been secured. We're all clear, too. Meet you at the med bay. Revan refuses to stay dead almost as much as Tenebrae. I don't trust him. Revan wants to see Tenebrae destroyed more than anyone who has ever lived. If you trust anything in this galaxy, Trust that. Come, the end is in sight.
Heskel's prophecy. At last, we are here. You will not stop this! You cannot stop this! You will never win! Vakorian's last vestige will be saved from your corruption! You were puppets! Fools! We were his true followers! Only we knew the true shape of his power! Of his plan! You were all puppets. The man you're so obsessed with never cared about any of you. Why should a god care for the insects beneath him? His designs were beyond any of us, and they will not be stopped. He is master of the Force, master of us all. To stand against such power is to be destroyed. He would have destroyed you regardless. If destruction is what you crave, you shall have it. I am the weapon of his will. None can stand against his power. Let's hope they were the last. Master Satil, she's still alive. But Trad and Syl are dead. And the rest aren't far from it. So much darkness. We have to hurry. Form a circle, quickly! I'll keep you covered from here, just in case any stragglers are hiding out. Theron? She's my mother. I'm glad I can help, but... I don't think I want to see the inside of her mind. Probably not. We're going to join our minds with Satil's to help her fight. Focus your minds on her. Watch her breathing and try to match it. Close your eyes. Let my voice guide you. Listen. Follow my voice. The Force unites us all. Through the Force, all things are one. Follow my voice. Follow. Since the others. I'm not sure if they made it in. Unexpected guests. Fascinating. Mm, just the voice I wanted to hear again. Who are you? I'm the one who's going to kill you. Ah, of course. Who else would come here so willingly? I've heard so much about you. There, good as new. Mm. 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 
Most impressive. What the? My wayward child. You of all people should know better than to challenge my strength. Or so I've gathered from this Jedi's memories. Your minds are resilient to say the least. Adapting so quickly. Resisting so ably. I hardened myself against these mind games before you ever tried. You don't remember? Hmm. This Jedi remembers. Though she clearly lacks details. You aren't who you pretend to be. I am. And I am not. That's your original body, isn't it? You're not Valkorian or Vitiate. You're Tenebrae. As shrewd as I've been led to believe. The ritual carved into him isn't a plague. It's an imprint. An echo of who he was back then. It has taken longer than I'd hoped to recompose myself. But time has never been in short supply. Not for me. To be honest. I've quite enjoyed the process. The memories this Jedi and her followers have of me, of us. Quite amusing. Let me know when you get to the part where I destroyed you. I'd love to hear your thoughts. But I have. And yet, here we are. Even your greatest victory failed to overcome the power, the vision that I possess. The version of me that you knew became too complacent, too distracted by mortal concerns, empires, wars, even a family. I have seen where that path led. I'm not so easily distracted now. I will succeed where he failed. And thanks to you, I have a choice of interesting bodies to carry me to victory.
to work on recovering Satil's memories. Those of you who don't know, these uh, scenes are from Tython. <laughs> you lash out with such conviction. Don't you see how pointless it all is? I control this place. All that happens, every motion occurs by my design. And you are no different. You cannot succeed. Only die alone. In the fight against you, no one is alone. He divided us. He knows that together, we are stronger than he can ever hope to be. I'd be honored to fight by your side. Together, we will end him. We'll find Sutil and the others at the center of all this. Come on!
you believed you had won. That your achievements outweighed your losses. That your sacrifices meant something. Anything. After all that I have done, all that I have enslaved, all that I have destroyed, you should have known. You do not know the true face of power, but you will. Very soon, you will. I hate these landscapes.
hold you. I control all that happens here. I am immortal, infinite, endless. So you always say. Everything ends, even you. I believe you tried to destroy me once before. You failed. I saved you then. I will not save you now. Fools! For those who aren't aware, the Jedi in white is the exile. He thinks you will be lost Republic. here forever. But you have always known the way to destroy him. Together, we will find his doom. Satil is stronger than this. Duplicate believes. She is not the easy prey he assumes. He gleans the facts of his other lives from the memories and impressions of Satil and her students. But he has only the knowledge of those events. This Tenebrae possesses none of the wisdom earned by experiencing them. You seem to know a lot about what's going on. I know only what you know. Do not share in his arrogance. He is more vulnerable than he would have us believe. But he is still the most dangerous being in the galaxy. If we fail to destroy him here and now, there may never be another opportunity. He is a relic of an era long past. Destroy him. Break the chains he uses to ensnare our soul. Free the galaxy from his manipulations. Avenge me. Avenge your soul. Everybody's so great with the pep talks today. Another ghost from the past. You are persistent. I was sure the Jedi exaggerated. I'm glad, actually. I'd hope to ask you something, just between us. Something no one else seems sure of. When I occupied your mind, did I control you? Or was it you who chose to murder my entire family? You never controlled me. I chose to kill them. Truly, you must have enjoyed it. To be so certain. How unfortunate they're not here to help you now. If only you... Fascinating. Today, we will have our justice. Of course you will. Your murderer stands before you. The Outlander will suffer in time. But he is not backed into a corner scrambling to survive. You may not have killed any of us yourself, but you're responsible for all of it. I like your markings. Do you like mine? Keep moving. Today isn't your day. 
It's his. How are you here? You're dead. You should ask yourself that question, not me. I killed you all once. Give me a reason and I'll do it again. You truly are a monster. Go. than I would have liked. They could have at least given wider pathways. What could you possibly be thinking? You must realize by now that everything you do here is meaningless. The Jedi's mind can no longer resist me. <laughs> it crumbles by the second. When she is obliterated, only I will remain. Watch, fight, flee, bring as many friends as you like. Nothing can stop me now. More words, more lies. You know this is the end for you. <laughs> Arrogant child! Look at them. Your Jedi and her weak-minded students. Barely clinging to life, to sanity. They will fall. And once again, I will rise. No. 
Your power is your weakness. It blinds you. Jedi nonsense. Precisely. My students and I, who are we to resist your power? You knew you could dominate us all. That you could tear a path through our minds, absorbing our essence, strengthening yourself, crashing through all our defenses one by one. In time, your victory was inevitable. In time, you would claw your way here, into the very core of my being. Into the heart of my trap. <laughs> trap. Look around you. Yes, look around me. Look at my students, each of them shaken to their core by the death and chaos that you helped create. Eager for help, guidance, strength. Had you focused on any one of them, you might have succeeded. But your ego wouldn't allow it. Why settle for one student when you could assault them all? And why limit yourself to the students when their master was close at hand? I never needed to beat you. I only had to let you think you were invincible. Until now. Until every person who knows your weakness firsthand could come to face you. Until the one person who proved you could be defeated came here to destroy you, once and for all. I command the force that binds the universe. I will not be killed by the ignorant tool of an empire I created. Don't worry. I'm not going to kill you. We're all going to kill you. Enough! You will all learn the true depths of my power. I am beyond your feeble comprehension. No, I can't I can't ever, ever again. The galaxy will be mine.
witness true power. You think you know me. Sequence, really. You will suffer. We can do this! And Vicious is the form that he took as the Sith Emperor. You would have seen that in certain sequences during the uh, Jedi Knight saga. No power over me. We've beaten you before. We'll beat you again. I cannot be denied. I am immortal. A Sith 
will grow beyond you. All your power cannot save you.
everything you've done. Everyone you've betrayed. Everyone you've manipulated. Everyone you've murdered. The Force seeks balance. Always. No! No! The Force is mine! I command it! I am uh, Endless! No. In the end, you are nothing. No! Welcome back. What is this? A victory party. The best I could do on short notice. We destroyed him. Utterly and forever. The Sith Emperor will never rise again. You always say that. I'm sure I've heard that before. Perhaps. But I think you know truth when you hear it. Where is everyone else? My son is helping Kira and Scourge. They're taking my surviving students to our old training grounds on Coruscant. The rest, Darth Mar, Valkorion's family, Mitra Surik, Revan. I believe they are one with the Force at last. Wait. How much time has passed? That's not important. You have given my son the home he always needed. I never expected someone like you to be the one to help him where I could not. But... He is content at last. Thank you. Theron is a good man and a good friend. I'm proud to be working with him. Today, we defeated the most evil and destructive being in history. Take care not to follow his path. Even with all his power, the weight of his wrongdoing dragged him to oblivion. That does not have to be your fate. Ah, you're awake. Shouldn't need this, then. Had an eventful day, have we? He's gone, Lana. Destroyed. Forever. I felt it. Kira and Scourge had me pick you up from the hangar. Apparently they were the first to wake from the ritual. You were unconscious for more than an hour. What happened? Tatil wanted a word with me. That must have been interesting. That's one way of putting it. You'll have to tell me all about it. But first, what heading should I set? Take us anywhere, as long as we're together. Wasn't that a sweet moment?
Aaron Lanier. I understand you have quite a story to tell. All right, and that is where we are going to conclude for now. When we return, we will be beginning the Spirit of Vengeance. I hope that you enjoyed today's content. Make sure you hit the notification bell so you don't miss anything that comes up next. And if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel, and I would greatly appreciate it. I'll see you all in the next one.